3 at 6 on KBTX. We've seen flooding all across the Brazos Valley, shutting down major roadways like FM 39 in Madison County. Tech stop Brian says they're on top of flooding and working hard to notify drivers of any standing water on roadways. News 3's Morgan Rydell joins us today with what drivers need to know. Morgan? That's right, crews could be seen monitoring conditions and putting barricades or signs around any potentially dangerous standing water on the roadways. I spent much of my day around Madisonville and Madison County where the rivers and streams have taken over a lot of big chunks of that area. You know, emergency responders in that area say drivers need to listen to those signs that they're putting out. We're just warning everybody, just please use extreme caution, and especially when it starts to get dark and you really can't see the water over the road. Shelley Butts, the Madison County Emergency Management Coordinator, says as far as infrastructure damage, the county has been lucky. But for residents, the message is about being careful in the car. FM 39 has a temporary closure right now between 1452 and 978. Um, we may see some more of those coming as the night progresses since we are looking at more rain coming. That, that roadway is under construction and with all the water that we've got, it's washed away a lot of the base. So we had to um, go out there and shut that road. Bob Colwell with Tech Brian says they've been busy, but until the rain passes, Colwell says much of their work won't start. Once that's done, unfortunately our work is not done. It's just beginning and then we will be out repairing and patching roadways. TxDOT says drivers need to be careful on those roadways, especially through the end of the night. Just slow down and be aware if you come across any standing water or road hazards in Madison County, you can contact 911 or any of those TxDOT locations around the Brazos Valley. Use the number on your screen. In the Digital Center, Morgan Rydell, News 3. Morgan, thank you.